When I was in school, I thought I wanted to be an artist, but it wasn't until I started making beer that I actually found an audience. You know, that I could make something that people they kind of got what I was doing. So, so I, you know, I, instead of being a photographer, I'm a brewer. I don't think I really started really loving beer until I drank Guinness, and Guinness just kind of totally, you know, threw me a cur curveball. I didn't know beer could look like that or taste like it, and that kind of really got me into beer. So I started making beer, and I've been doing it for 20 years. The humble legend, he's an artist. I mean, he has, what, it's like 14, 15 Great American Beer Fest medals, which is crazy. It's a combination of these recipes that Jonathan has been formulating basically since he started brewing. So over the years, he's perfected every ingredient that needs to go in there. I think that a lot of the, the artistry in Port City comes from our uh, simplicity in what we do. Kind of pulling towards old styles and uh, older way of doing things and the, the, the original artistry of making beer and pulling more from that world. It's kind of a slightly different model than I think what's going on in general, where, where people are like kind of like, you know, the flavor of the week. Take it down to the simpler things, um, very few ingredients, and just kind of making it the best that we can make it. And it's hard to make those simple beers that are perfect to style. Very clean beers, just beers without flaws. Balance and drinkability and complexity and, you know, I mean that you want to have another one. It's beer. It's like liquid bread. I mean, it's, it's, it's like a staple. There's no pretentiousness about beer. You know, I think if you do it right, it could be, uh, it's, it's just a beautiful thing. It's art. Yeah, it can be more than just kind of like white bread. It can be, it can be like, you know, like pumpernickel or, or you know, or something different, you know. Brewing is one of those industries where you can get that happy medium between art and science. There's a lot of little things that go into brewing and fermenting and cellaring and kegging and bottling. So it's high quality ingredients, it's you know, a good recipe, and uh, it's having this nice equipment and also making sure that everything is clean, uh, making sure that when he follows the procedures. Our boss teaches us this way of how you should do it, and that comes with passion and hard work. I mean, you gotta be passionate, you gotta learn the basics before you can make it your own. I think we're janitors, scientists, and creators. Hey. Don't let your mother smell that beer in your breath. She'll take it out on me. I mean, this is like the, the golden age of, of microbrews right now. We've had a fair amount of success. It's kind of been a whirlwind. We're growing so fast. There have been years where we've grown close to 100% in a year, and it's just crazy. Two years ago at GABF, we, we won four medals, which is very exciting. This year, uh, when we won three medals for our three of our flagship beers, and then we won Best Small Brewery, it was amazing. It's a tangible asset. It says that our beer is of high quality. And proper, man. You know, it's like it's pro it's got to be proper. And if it's not there, then the quality's not there. You know, I don't think we'd be Small Brewery of the Year if we didn't have that from the top. Maybe we'll come back in a couple of years and we didn't win best uh, mid-sized brewery of the year. I mean, I don't know. Like making a movie or something that you need like a crew of people to do this. It's like not just the director that makes a film a great film. It's like you know, it's the you know, it's the screenwriter, it's the editor, it's the cinematographer, it's the actors. It's all these different people that come together and make a great film. And I think we have a really great team right now. The best team we've had since we worked here. So I think everybody who brews here had their hands on all the beers that won medals, and I think that's not a coincidence.
I feel like we just keep getting better, honestly. I mean, we were fantastic when I started here three years ago, and it's just, it's just getting better. Everybody cares. Everybody cares about not only growing this brand, but beer in general. As long as we can grow and maintain quality and, you know, uh, not piss off our customers, you know, I mean, you know, basically serve our customers, you know, maintain their loyalty, you know, then I think, yeah, I think we'll be okay. We're still pretty small right now, but hopefully um, sometime soon we'll be able to go anywhere in the United States and be able to see our name and have our recognition out there somewhere. Keep drinking beer. Keep drinking it. Don't stop.